Hey guys, it's We Helper 99. It is December 28th, 2011. I would like to wish you all a late Merry Christmas. I've noticed that I haven't made any videos lately, so today I decided to make one since I'm on holiday break. So I, I'll be reviewing the the one of the Android phones from Public Mobile called the Max. I've noticed there's not one review on YouTube, so to help you guys out, if you're looking. If you're looking for a review of this phone, I will help you out. So the phone comes into this box. By the way, this phone is only available in Canada, in uh, the provinces of Quebec and Ontario. Anyways, here we have the, the box of the phone. Inside the box, I was able to find, obviously, the cell phone, the battery pack, two-piece charger, which comes with the wall charger and the computer charger. You could charge this phone t two ways a quick start guide and a user manual so now let's get into the phone here is the phone the phone in front comes with a 3.2 inch touchscreen display a front facing camera and by the way this is the only phone that public mobile has with a front facing camera a menu button home button and a back button that's what's in the front of the phone in the back of the phone we got the media speaker this is the speaker used I don't know if you guys could see it that well this is the speaker that uh, the phone uses to play music, games, videos and all stuff like that we got here we got the 3.2 inch 3.2 megapixel camera which is actually not that bad I tested it out I'll post a video of it and here we got the public mobile logo. Let's go on to the sides. On, on the right side of the phone, we have the volume up and volume down button. On top of the phone, we have the power button. On the, other, on the left side of the phone, we got a headphone jack. And at the bottom of the phone, we got a, the USB plug. This is what uh, you plug in the USB into the wall or in the computer. This phone is surprising because it actually looks like the iPhone, but it runs Android 2.3. Because if you notice, the iPhone also has a silver base band around the phone. This thing does have one too. The iPhone has the front facing camera, this one has it. But the iPhone is much better as it's much, it's designed by a better company. And by the way, this phone is designed by UMX. So let's get into the phone. So, to turn the phone on, we would have to press the power button. Now, you would put in the password. Now, the phone won't come with a with a uh, automatic password. I put my own. So I'm just going to log in. So now you're logged in. So it starts off with the 2.3 Android Smart Thing. So here, here when I just opened it, it had nothing, but I put in my own apps and everything. And here at the top, we have this speaker icon, which is very useful, and it's like Siri. For example, I'll show you one of the things that you could talk, tell it. Search YouTube. And as you can see, it searched YouTube. Which is really cool. Another thing that it could do is this. Text public mobile. And there you go. I could text the public mobile customer service. And I could see a message. This is a test. And there you go, this is a test. It's really cool. And then uh, that's one of the things I really love this phone. So there is one thing that's cool on it. Let's go into the menu option. So since I went to a public mobile, I get this info portal, which is very useful. It's 
seems like the internet is down on my Wi-Fi. Oh, there you go. Anyways, this info portal is really cool because you could get ev everything from news to sports to weather instantly on this info portal, which I found really amazing because instead of downloading apps like the weather network or stuff like that, you could just you could just go on the info portal, find what you want. Like for example, I could go on TSN. Look, I could find the scores for tonight's hockey games, but there's nothing that's uh, that nothing sports related on, so it won't show me anything for now. Anyways, so that's the info portal app with that comes with public mobile. Next, I'll show you the camera. This cam the the cameras are front facing and back facing. I'll show you first how the front facing looks like. So there you go. The front facing, it's not laggy at all. It's a little bit pixeled, but you could have many options. So here, this option, we could zoom in. Let me try to test it like this with one hand. Yeah, it's not working well. So here we could zoom in, but if the more you zoom in, the worse the picture quality becomes. Here we could have a balance to it. I put it on automatic, but let's say you're taking a picture in daylight. You could put it to daylight. The picture should become much uh, brighter. We have the store location. And we have focus mode. I put it on auto. We have exposure. We have picture size. I put three megapixels. We have picture quality. It's on super fine since you want the best. I have color effect. It's on none. This is also really cool because you, you could take a picture like sepia. Picture becomes yellow. And you can restore to the faults of let's say you made a mistake. So that's another thing that's really cool. Uh, this uh, this phone I really recommend it. It's actually really loud. The speaker is really loud. I'll actually play you a video. Let me go on YouTube.com. I'm gonna put a song. Uh, I'll even show you on oh, their mind. I'll put on dance Akuduro. This phone is also really good because if you're a customer who likes who like who's always on the go and needs a limited data, once you get this phone, you are obliged to get unlimited data, and, it, and for the first month it's free, and for the next six months it's only thirty-five bucks a month, and after the other six months you would have to pay forty-five dollars, which is pretty good because if you would go with a service like Bell, Rogers, Telus, or any of them, those are private providers. For fifty bucks a month, you can only get five hundred megabytes of data. Here, for forty-five bucks a month only, you get unlimited text. International, limited talk nationwide, and limited data nationwide. So now I'm going to play you the song and see how I'm going to show you. So that's how loud. So that's how loud the speakers are. I'm going to put them full blast. This speaker is really loud, so if you're a party animal, I recommend this phone for you. Anyways, guys, I, I rate this phone 5 out of 5. I recommend it for everyone who needs a cheap phone. Android, you want to look cool. Android is the best. You can look at how cool my background is. It's the same as the Nexus S. It's really cool phone. Anyways, guys, 
Go check this phone out at Public Mobile. I'm out.